We're being filmed because we're important. We're important. We're important. Hey guys, we're gonna play Pokemon Go today. This is Monette's first time actually playing it. I got my uh, the shirt <laughs> that resembles Pokemon in some way. I'm gonna do naughty things to my Pokemon. Naughty I don't things. Want to know. I like them to watch <laughs> me do weird things to myself. Just the Pokemon and I alone. Let's go play a Pokemon again. <laughs> you know what we look like? We look like um, two people trying to make a successful YouTube video right now. <laughs> Looks like modern this, romance. This, this to is me. like modern. This is, yeah, this, is, <laughs> this is a normal first date. <laughs> yeah. There's a sand shirt here. I just gotta turn around real fast. Hi, right, another street, you yeah. fucker. I missed Tony. You're standing in front of my sand shirt. <laughs> I got it. Oh, it bounced off Tony. Thanks, Tony. <laughs> it actually made a big difference. Oh, yeah, you know. Son of a bitch. I'm gonna do naughty things to this sand shirt. <laughs> keep it moving, keep it moving. Guys, I think it's a good day. All I wanted to capture was one Pokemon at least. You know, I believe in the one step at a time theory. But a sand though? A sand shoe gets the job done. Mm, I think a Diglett gets the job done. Ah, uh, Diglett does get the job done. <laughs> We're thinking about the same thing, right? Hey. Tell you what, huh. the next time a Pokemon appears, I'll let you capture them. <gasps> For real? Yeah. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch him off. I used to say the same thing about diseases. <laughs> Imagine playing this in New York, though. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey. I'm trying to catch fucking Charmander here. There's a Mewtwo on your fucking pizza. There's a Mewtwo on your pizza. <laughs> Let me have the pizza. Pokemon in Mexico? <laughs> hey, man, there's a Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ooh, there's a help center here. Might be able to find Pokemon at the help center. All right, everyone's looking at us through the window. <laughs> just, just don't. <laughs> Looking for Pokemon, people. Just looking for Pokemon. Just looking for Pokemon. It's no big deal. They understand. They understand. That's uncomfortable. <laughs> what are all these things coming up? Valley car wash. What? Whatever you tap on. Oh, you're too far away. But when you're close, you spin it. Like Shit. Pokeballs or uh, potions. So we can get her some Pokeballs. Yeah. We're gonna get you some Pokeballs. What's up, man? We're doing really important things right now. <laughs> <laughs> what? what happened? What's that? Oh, here, you can capture it. Aww. Switch phones with me. It's a, it's a, ah! What is it? An Abra? An, an Abra? Don't it's fuck a, this up, Monette. Tony, you're standing in front of the Abra. Okay. <laughs> Ready, ready? Go, go for it. Ah! I got it? Yes. <laughs> I got an Abra. <laughs> I spent years searching for this Abra. <laughs> Wondering, will one ever be able to obtain such an Abra? It's time to cross. It's time to cross, guys. Let's go. <laughs> that way? Here. Really? You can't spin it? Yeah, you can spin it. You're gonna get some Pokeballs. I got three. Yeah, you got three Pokeballs. I got five. You tap, <laughs> tap it, tap it. Oh, you gotta tap them? I didn't tap any of them. Good. <laughs> Try again later. Oh, fuck you, car wash. You need to find just the blue tile fountain. I'm running low on Pokeballs. It's pissing me off. This game brings out the worst in me. <laughs> it gives me hiccups. <laughs> Wait, there's another Abra? Where? Oh, son of a. Do it, you can do it. You're throwing it too ah. hard. Do you I'm think the Abra's way over there or right here in front of you? Come on. It keeps jumping. It's yeah, jumping. it keeps jumping. It's trying to dodge the ball. What do you think? He's just going to stand there? It's called the hunt. you got to capture your prey. <sighs> you got the Abra. Ah. Hell yeah. It's actually Tony's phone because hers wasn't working, so she got Tony and Abra. <laughs> I like walking at this kind of pace. I'm kind of walking like my character does. My character walks like this. And there's another fountain, there's two fountain places here. Hold on, there's one on the left and one on the right. Oh crap, I got the Horatio Biblico. That's what I said. Thank you, I appreciate it. Got all the Pokeballs from it. You should oh. never trust your best friend, Monette. I know I'm your best friend. <laughs> Monette's best friend, it's pretty sad. We didn't really spend a lot of time together, <laughs> but she, she considers me her best friend these days. It's pretty awesome of her. I don't really 
friends are my best friend. Kind of weird. Obsession. Oh, Horario. It's a hospice center. I used to not believe in hospice centers. Now I see they care about the youth. I'm a Pokemon trainer! I got nothing. A goddamn Greg <laughs> Alba! This is a gym. A place where you test your skills at oh, Pokemon. Oh, what battles. is that smell? Do you smell that? That's a smell of sweat. The Pokemon will be sweating out once I'm done with them. <laughs> I can't go to the gym until I reach level five. Now you're a free spirit. <laughs> you're a delight. You're like out of an independent comedy. As a Pokemon trainer, when you have a partner, you gotta learn to work with your partner. Communicate. Communicate. Communication is key. Oftentimes, especially when I look the way I do, and she looks the way she does, a woman is likely to fall in love with said trainer. It happens. <laughs> I must be clear, Monette. We are only working together to capture Pokemon. Really? We cannot do anything. I don't want to be with you. Only for the Pokemon. Okay, if you insist. That's called good communication. <laughs> now leave her, Steven. We have searched for minutes for Pokemon. None have appeared. Why are we playing this? <laughs> It's too goddamn hot out here. There's no Pokemon. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. I can't put the phone down. Uh, let's keep looking. I'm sure we'll be able to find one. As long as we keep looking, we can find one, guys. We can find one. Just one more. Just one. one more. Just, just one. one more. I, I just want one more. I can stop whenever I want. Oh, oh, this is so exhausting. Oh. Oh. No more. They're gone. Where'd they go? I'm never gonna be able to get to level five at this rate. Tony's on level seven. How the fuck is Tony on level seven? Tony? <laughs> it really is a game of patience. It is. It really is a way to teach us how to be warriors out there. As much as we're training the Pokemon, the Pokemon are training us as well. To be persistent, to not give up in battle. Oh, you can probably battle people that were in the OBGYN center. What, did you find one? Son of a... What? Son of a find? Sand Shrew! Yeah, Already you catch got it. a Sand Shrew. Oh, we can't catch the same one twice? I, you don't want two Sand Shrews? Once I'm done with one, I'll move on to the next. What do I do exactly? Not tell you. <laughs> Alright guys, well, we're gonna head back home now. One step at a time. You know, you don't want to get a sore muscle from all the exercise of catching the Pokemon, because it's also a workout. It's more than just a mentality. It's more than just a, a philosophy, a way of living. Being a Pokemon trainer, it involves your health too, really, it does. It's hard out here in the streets of- You gotta take glucosamine for the knees, because you don't want to get bad joints from all the walking you do as a trainer. Where are and, we? Uh, we're uh, in Van Nuys. Sorry. So you capture the most dangerous kind of Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Go home now, relax, build up, work up to it. Get like 10 minutes today. <laughs> Maybe 20 tomorrow. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you guys. Yeah. Subscribe to my next channel. <laughs> Tony, you can sit here. specific yet. Let's just say there'll be a little bit of uh, Hitmonchan. <laughs> what? 